This is breaking news from Channel 13 Eyewitness News. And we begin tonight with something going terribly wrong on a carnival ride full of children. A part fell from the ride, hitting a child and sending debris flying. Now this happened on opening night of the Beach Grove Fall Festival. Our David McAnally spoke with people who were eyewitnesses to exactly what happened. David. Andrew, it's still unclear why that long metal bar carrying lights fell from a position above one of those carts on the ride back there, the scrambler, but it came down on a person, caused some minor injuries. His friend told us that he was a real trooper. As the scrambler starts up, 34 seconds into the video, you almost miss it. But you see from the scramble, something's happened. Now slow it down and hear a witness describe it. Most of my friends were on the ride already, but we got like split up. And we just heard this like loud noise and like the lights on the scrambler like caved in and like it smacked him in the face. Like all I saw were all my friends like they were like boyfriend and girlfriend and like the boyfriends were just like toppling over all the girls and like trying to save them. The ride closed down right away. The broken light bar lying in the bed of a carnival maintenance truck, unclear if the bar was damaged before or after it fell off the ride. We're told the boy, about 17, had a minor injury to the face. He was checked by medics at the scene. His mother took him to the hospital to be checked out. For fair organizers, this is my 39th year doing this festival and this is the first time we have ever had an incident like that and we've been with the same carnival for 39 years it was just a freak thing that's poor jacks it's a freak thing that happened and they are we are they're a top-notch organization pretty scary to see this heck yeah I, I didn't even know what to do I was just like standing there I was like I didn't even know like I was so startled the fair organizer told us that all of the rides got a complete inspection before the fair opened today, including the Scrambler ride. He said that uh, inspectors will be back again tomorrow searching for an answer as to why this happened. Back to you, Andrea. David, thank you. And as David just mentioned, this ride had been inspected for safety before the festival began. Indiana state law mandates that all temporary rides go through an inspection at least once a year. Inspectors look over the mechanics of the rides to make sure they are assembled properly. They also check for the right kind of seat belts or other restraints, and they also check the training of the operator.